hashtag fella, <laughs> tweeted this weekend, thanks Seattle Times for this list of people who made fun of Paul Pelosi. Let's hold them accountable. And, you know, he's got this list of the people who amplified this conspiracy theory that the guy who broke into Paul Pelosi's home didn't break into his house. He was actually his gay lover, which was, you know, a lie. It was a lie from the get-go. Well, why was Paul Pelosi in his underwear? Well, because it was in the middle of the night. And he'd been dragged, he'd been woken up and dragged out of bed. So who was amplifying this conspiracy theory? Well, Ted Cruz, Marjorie Taylor Greene, Clay Higgins. These are all members of Congress. Clay Higgins, Mark Robinson. He's the lieutenant governor of North Carolina. Mary Williams Benefield, the Republican State House candidate in Georgia. Royce White. Republican State House candidate in Minnesota, Senator Wendy Rogers, Republican of Arizona, State Representative Anthony uh, Sabatini, Republican of Florida, Representative Claudia Tenney, Republican of New York, and then these prominent figures, Glenn Beck, Megyn Kelly, Tucker Carlson, Elon Musk, Dinesh D'Souza, Devin Nunes, Ryan Fournier, Michael Savage, Sebastian Gorka, Roger Stone, Pete Hegseth, Donald J. Trump, right? These are the people who were, who were spreading this vicious lie to justify an attempted murder of the husband of the Speaker of the House of Representatives. And the people who listen to them, I mean, this, this guy called into a radio station from, uh, I guess he's out of jail now, on bail. He called into a radio station the day before yesterday and said, you know, I, I should have killed them all. I'm sorry, I failed. It's amazing.